It's another sea bass. Holy shit, a sea bass. This shit right here. This. This is the Mahi Mahi. And I pulled it up too late. That shit was fast. That might have been our chance. Oh my god! Don't forget to follow me on all my social media and join me on my live streams. We play Animal Crossing every Monday, Friday, and that's my stream schedule for right now. And I upload every Tuesday and Friday as well. What's up, Animal Crossing guys and gals? We're back at it again with more May exclusive fish. Today, we're going to be trying to catch the Mahi Mahi since we didn't get them last time. I overly prepared and we got 100 bait. And if we don't get them with this 100 bait, I... I, I don't I don't know I, I the game hates me at that point the game just doesn't want me to catch the damn thing and he's pretty and big and colorful and and you know I, I just I'm being abused by Animal Crossing send help Tom Nook is in control of everything my life um, my living style uh, which also pertains to life so why am I saying that and and just he just controls my my everything my diet my sleeping arrangements um, I'm actually nailed to the chair right now. I can't get up. I, I've been stuck here since the last time you saw the video. Uh, all I have really is to drink this water. I've been drinking it for a week. But um, other than that, I've been farming for fish bait. And hopefully we can catch him because maybe I'll get some slight approval and get food once again. So, um, yes. Hashtag cancel Tom Nook. That's where we should start. Okay, anyway, aside from that, we're going to catch some Mahi Mahi today, hopefully, and then um, we're going to go try and catch some other fish that we can catch uh, throughout the night as well. So, wish me luck. Here we go. The endless trials of the Mahi Mahi. Thank you for wishing me luck. I don't know if you liked the video. I don't know if you commented and wished me luck or shared the video with a friend, but your asses better do it now. I even made sure to uh, change up our fishing pole. It's the, uh, the green one that's kind of like related to his colors a little bit. Um, also, if you haven't seen the last episode from Tuesday, you guys should go back and see that. Also, I do like the bobber in this uh, fishing pole better than the others. He hello, okay. I didn't know if the fish bait was actually going to spawn the fish because it took a second. Also, guys, comment down below. What is your favorite fish in the game right now during the month of May? It could be any of them. It could even be, you know, ones that have already existed like the sea bass that last all friggin year or it could just be some of the may exclusive fish which one's your favorite we still have to catch a couple we have to go catch an angel fish a frog i've caught a frog already i just have to show you guys me catching the frog for the video so we're gonna get to that eventually as soon as this little shit gets over to the bopper All right, we got more butterfly fish. Let's go. All right, we've got butterfish. We've got snappers. We've got sea bass. We've got zebras, turkeys, and fish all in one, but we can't get a friggin' mahi-mahi. Come on, damn it. We even have squid. I do like how they debuted the, uh, the butterfly fish, the surgeon fish, and the clownfish all at the same time because of, like, Finding Nemo, which is pretty cool. You know, this might end up being a series. Tech uses 100 bait. What fish can he catch? Not the ones that he needs. <gasps> oh my god. I finally caught a barrel eye. I've been trying to catch this for two months. This is freaking great. At least this is a plus. And the fishing pole broke. Our, okay, well, so after what? 10, 20... Almost 30 pieces of bait your fishing pole breaks after catching like 30 fish because that was a brand new fishing pole Dude, this is freaking sick. I Finally caught a barrel eye Hell yeah, I am glad that that's the fish that the pole broke for and that's something like stupid and generic like a sea bass I know this is late in the video, but for you guys that are still watching What's your favorite phrase from a fish and what's your favorite phrase from a bug? Yo, what is this? Oh, uh, it's sea bass. Nothing <laughs> different. Just another sea bass. One of my favorites is the stringfish. It's five more and you get a guitar fish. I think the other one's probably a red snapper. 
I've always really liked that fish. That was weird. Like the seahorse like like flew to our hand, then stopped for a second, and then went back to our hand. That was weird. Maybe I'm just seeing things. I don't know. I've been fishing so much. What the hell? Another barrel eye? What are the odds? That's insane. It took me months to get a literal months to get a barrel eye. And I would go every night and try and catch a couple and I'd, I'd stop at like 10, 15, 20. And I'm like, okay, we'll do it another night. And then now in this one session, I caught two barrel eye after using 10, 20, 30, 40 pieces of bait. What the hell? You know, if, if you notice and you look at the inventory, I've thrown a bunch of bait, but I've only caught four sea bass and I haven't missed a single fish. And when I went and emptied my inventory, we only had two sea bass. So they might have like toned down the spawn rate of sea bass, which would be really cool if they did. Because we don't need any more sea bass. We have too many. There's way too many friggin' sea bass. Alright guys, we had to go make more poles because uh, the other one broke as well, so... Now we're back to the regular pole with uh, nothing fancy. We have to go buy fancy ones from the store. It'd be sick if we caught a third barrel eye. Or no, two more barrel eyes. Because then we could have a really cool statue of them later. It's another sea bass. Holy shit, a sea bass. Yo. Barrel eye number three. Let's go. All right, guys. I'm a complete moron, so I had to save the replay because out of the three barrel eye I caught... I still never read the friggin' thing to you guys. I caught a barrel eye. It's like eyeing fish in a barrel. I like it. Let's go. So that means if we get another barrel eye, we'll have enough for when CJ comes and we'll get a really badass statue. That'll be pretty sick. Because right now, I'm not too hopeful about the Mahi Mahi. Uh, I think it's probably a safer bet to just keep catching barrel eye. Because I don't know, dude. <laughs> I don't know. Also keep in mind that we have a hundred pieces of bait and we haven't caught an ore fish. We haven't caught another one of the trevallis. And we definitely haven't caught a Mahi Mahi because, you know, that's the whole point of this video. <laughs> Yo, yeah, this is barrel line number four. This is barrel line number four. Is it? No, it's a butterfly fish. <laughs> they start with a B. This shit right here. This. This is the Mahi Mahi. No, it's not. It's a olive flounder. Look, guys, Raymond decided to pay us a visit. And he walks along the beach. All right, guys, we officially only have 10 bait left. If we can't get a Mahi Mahi, please let us get a fourth barrel eye. That'd be super sick. You know, at this point, I think they're just teasing me. They keep giving me the small fish. I'm like, yeah, it could be another barrel eye. It's not. It's mackerels and seahorses. I think that was the Mahi Mahi. And I pulled it up too late. That shit was fast. That might have been our chance. Alright, last piece of bait. Uh, we'd wish us luck. What is it? Oh my god! Dude, yes! I caught a Mahi Mahi. It's all Mahi Mahi. Dude, yes! Holy shit! Thank you for wishing me luck. I don't know if you liked the video. I don't know if you commented and wished me luck or shared the video with a friend, but your asses better do it now because we got the friggin' Mahi Mahi and we got the giant Trevally. Oh my god, yes!
Alrighty guys, uh, before we end this video, we're going to do a couple things. We've got to thank all the fish for their service of being caught for the greater cause of catching the Mahi Mahi. A hundred pieces of bait and we got them. This is, uh, this is what the boy looks like in the inventory. Here's the giant Trevally. And then here's the barrel eye. I'm going to go put the other two in my house somewhere until we get a third one. And then we're going to have a barrel eye statue. I'd like to get a Mahi Mahi statue and a giant Trevally statue, but uh, I'm not going to do 400 more bait. Or no, there'd be 600 more bait because it'd be 100 each to get them. <laughs> These are the boys next to each other. We're going to turn on the lights. Brighter. It's better. They look beautiful. I'm so happy we got them. All right, that's them. That's the barrel eye. I don't know why they turn blue when you put that really bright, but they're cool. And as per usual, we're going to show all the fish in the light, just like we did with the string fish. So let's go barrel eye. Looks beautiful in the light. Mahi Mahi. Dude, you're a freaking baller. You're a beautiful ass fish. And the Trevally. I think I definitely like the Barrel Eye the best. Even though it's like not like May exclusive. I caught him in May, so like this fish is badass. We got the big exclusive fish out the way. So next time, we're going to be getting the fish in the pond and the river, but we're not done yet. I know I keep teasing you guys to get out of the video, but we're going to give these fish to Blathers one by one, and we're going to learn about each of them and the fun facts about them. All right, Blathers, tell us about the barrel eye. He's a deep sea fish with protuberant eyes and a clear head, so some of his organs are visible. That's creepy. At first, Blathers, tra transparent, I can't read. A transparent head seems absurd, but there is a reason so it can see things directly above. That's pretty crazy. But I must confess, the more I learn about the deep sea fish, the happier I am to live on dry land. All right, let's go. All right, next we're doing the giant Trevally, and then we're going to do the Mahi Mahi last. The giant Trevally, as benefits, it's as befits its name jesus still can't read can reach six feet in length and 180 pounds that's a big ass fish its size and strength have made it a favorite opponent for anglers since time in, in, in memory the day i can read it's over <laughs> ingenious hunters sometimes taking advantage of other predators to distract their prey there have been documented cases of them attacking birds that's wild I love the way he says it. That was so cute. My, my. <laughs> Let's go, Blathers. That was a terrible impersonation, but still, dude, it was adorable. He's an ocean fish known for its wide, somewhat cute face. It can reach over six feet long. It's known by different names, including dolphin fish, even though it has no relation to dolphins. They live only in warm tropical waters, which perhaps explains the relaxed, happy look on their faces. All right, let's go. All right, sick. All right, guys, there's the Mahi Mahi in the big ass tank with the rest of them. All right, anchovy, we already caught that. The blue marlin, we've already caught that. The tuna, we've already caught that. We caught those on stream, by the way. And the giant Trevally, all caught within the week. So let's go. And they were all donated today, so. All right, that's pretty sick. Now we just have to find the barrel eye. Where is he at? Yo, there he is. There he is. Look at him. His wonderful, cute everything. He's adorable. Actually, like, I like all the fish in here because, like, they're super, super, like, deep sea fish. And they're pretty sick. Dude, the ore fish is, is like, his story is so sad. I don't know if you guys know, but, like, Blathers tells you the only time he ever goes up to the surface is when he's ready to die. So when we caught him, we were preventing him 
from killing himself. Justice for Orfish, please. Alright guys, thank you so much for watching. We caught the big fish, we got them out of the way, and now we're going to focus on the fish in the pond, in the river. So join us for the next one to two episodes, and I'll see you guys next time. Don't forget to follow me on all my social media, and join me on my live streams. We play Animal Crossing every Monday, Friday, and that's my stream schedule for right now. And I upload every Tuesday and Friday as well. So I hope to see you guys come hang out for some Animal Crossing discussion, fun, fishing stuff, all that good stuff. You can come over to my island. I can go over to your island. We can do whatever. It'll be a good time. And uh, like I said before, follow me on all my socials to keep up to date with me. Instagram, I'm probably the most active on. I'm not really that active on Twitter. I just kind of post every now and then. But yeah, thanks again, guys. And I'll see y'all next time.